Hello Doom fans and welcome to PJ Plays Doom, I'm Peter Horse. And in this episode, I am playing for the first time with the MBF Megawad Valiant by Skillsaw. I'll be going for all monsters, items and secrets while sustaining no damage whatsoever. On map 14, Implosion. So let's join the live commentary on attempt number 40. So everything opens up when I grab the shotgun and shower, so let's do that. Come on, come on, follow the explosion. Yeah, I somehow avoided being hit. I have no idea how I managed it because I really want the barrels to detonate sooner than that. But it is a lovely safe place to be. I grabbed that box of shells and I think that distant ching gun I got into a fight with the imps immediately, which is exactly what I want. I'm going to try dragging some imps this way and raising them up on the platform. That's a lovely crop. Yeah, you'll be noticing various modifications made by Skillsaw for Valiant. Come on, Arachnatron. And, uh, yeah, the, the modified pistol fires faster. And these imps look different, they've got more horns, I, I call them horny imps. They fire faster with a burst of two fireballs instead of one. I've got to be careful of those distant fireballs. But obviously I need to kill the imps nearest to me so that I can get out of here safely. Yeah, when I was investigating this map for no damage tactics, I had to, um, it was a really big moment when I found this safe place that I could get to. If the uh, chain gunners and uh, barrels and mancabus cooperated. Which they did this time. Just keeping an eye out for those distant fireballs. I'll just shoot them myself because my ammo amounts are doing very well. And yeah, some extra imps are still arriving here, so it really wouldn't be sensible for me to drop down too early and start going back towards the starting area. Watch out, these imps can lurk dangerously near to his side. But there's still, there's still two there. Just get this last one. Yes. I lost my bearings there for a minute, I didn't know which way I was facing. Right, I've got those extra shells, and I'll now kill this Arachnatron. You've uh, outlived your usefulness. Now you must die. And, um, we might be about to see another value modification, potentially. Yes, an Arachnor. Doesn't it look cute? It's like it's holding a knife and fork. Oh no, 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 don't die. I'll let it get a bit close to me because I wanted you, to, you guys to get a good look at it, but that's quite dangerous. Anyway, I got away with it. And uh, 61 kills, that's a lot at this stage, so I think... Just double checking this area. There's no mobile imps on their way. Here, it's time to see another value modification. I'm going to keep those barrels alive I could say because I can detonate them now when monsters teleport in there's probably more to arrive is that it? nope that's probably everything and yes, his super chain gun is probably most people's favourite Valiant modification. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. 
So it fires a lot faster than the normal machine gun. And to compensate, Skill Soul made it that you can carry more bullets. I don't want to overuse it at this stage because there are some moments where I really want that increased killing power. Okay, so I'll grab items as I go. They're sort of scattered everywhere, the items, but uh, a bit like Ultimate Doom. But I can't be cut off from any items unless I missed those first 10 health bonuses before, you know, right at the start of the map. Eight enemies in this track. I'll let them see me first. Still three remaining. Oh, they were all chain gunners. And you'll notice the chain gunners. I'll just get this plasma rifle secret. The chain gunners don't drop chain guns. So Skill Saw made the chain gun better, but also made it harder to pick up, which is a nice touch. Right. Um, there's some more monsters I can blow up now. Actually, these imps need to go. Yeah, I think I need to blow up those barrels first. Because uh, autoing wouldn't let me hit the imps otherwise. That's it, okay. And now. Yes, that's everything from here. And I'll pick up these bonuses as well, why not? Right, so now for the area where I had to block out my room for this. Uh, I had to block out the light because it's quite dark. I want to snipe. No, you don't. Come on. <sighs> He's got me a few times. Him. Come on. Yes. I just need to be careful as I as I come around into this dark cave sort of area. Two shotgun guys are about to be activated. Can I shoot the top of that one? Yes, I can. I just discovered that tactic right now. Oh, that makes this bit safer. Oh, that's nice to know. Imp being a bit tanky. Okay, so I've done that part. I think this is attempt number 40. I will now... I'm here for the Mega Armor Secret. And. Oh, yeah, some more shells, that's handy. And here as well. Right. Um, now it's time for this red key trap. I'm gonna detonate some chain gunners and I'm gonna retreat from some other hit scanners. Just been taking that red key. Make some monsters with those barrels. I'm a bit nervous doing this. Yeah, I don't know exactly which way the monsters are going to approach. Many other Valiant maps are bigger than this one, and this one neatly subdivides into discrete traps which I've been able to practice. Which is why it's uh, one of the first ones I've figured out for no damage play. That's right, you heard that right guys, this is not the only Valiant map that I've got ideas for. So watch this space. Right. So I think I'm all clear at the moment. It's now time to go for the yellow key trap. And a Cacodemon will open up on the right, so I'll blow that one up quickly, hopefully. Barrels didn't want to cooperate. May as well try to use those barrels. I've got a 
be careful in case they're coming the other way. Retreating up to here should give me a good view of everything. Oh bloody hell! Oh no! My agony continued. Here's attempt number 41. I'll head over here. Like this some more. Oh bollocks! I'm not focusing! Yep, another silly mistake and I'm hurt by a horny imp. Much later the same day, I recorded attempt number 124. Okay, so we start off in this outdoor area, grabbing some shells and health bonuses. I need to get all of them, because when these doors close, I can't go back. Okay, it's time to enjoy blowing some things up. Valiant style. I see the imps have already started. Oh yes, I got away with it. The Mancopus has died and I've taken over his safe place. Uh, it was his safe place because the monsters would tease him about his weight. Attempt number 125. It's hard for paranoia not to set in. Right, let's kill you at this one. I don't want to blow up the barrels on the right, I'm saving them up for another monster trap. Oh, look at the cute little arachnol. Looks like it's holding a knife and fork, but his, his fangs, it's like part of the arachnatron that rises up out of the dead body. It's a really nice, uh, well, they look cute, it'd be nice if they could be neutered and then I could have them as a pet. And we're about to see another Valiant modification, oh no, that's firing at me, that's those distant imps. Oh, calm down. Right. Okay. Might as well grab that box of bullets. The amounts. Oh dear, I missed the teleport. I've never done that. The amounts of ammo have changed because the chain gun fires faster. You can carry 300 bullets instead of 200, and you get 75 bullets in a box instead of 50. Um, okay, now it's time for finding out why I saved up these barrels. There are eight monsters in there. I'll blow up the barrels now. Enemies left. That chingon was hiding. All of the keys are booby trapped. So I'll open up some chingoners here, kill them, and then retreat. So some distant enemies are approaching. I'll see if I can use the barrels. Yes, I think that's everything. We're up to 116 monsters. I've got smart totals off, by the way, so that when the uh, Arachnorp was made, it was actually an extra monster. And if I had smart totals on, it would mess up the monster count. That's why my monster count looks a bit different from usual, in case you were wondering. Now for the yellow key, which is also booby trapped. Let's 
kill that first Kakademon quickly. I hope to kill some monsters with those barrels. That's nice. And now I can use the barrels in here, although they're cleverly blowing them up ahead of time. Gotta be careful that they don't approach me from unexpected angles. Any imps hiding from me? Nope. Sometimes we are coming on the far side of this central barrier. Okay. I don't have to use the super chain gun here, so I won't. I want to save up the bullets. More imps hiding around here. I just have to be a little bit boring. And just keep retreating and shooting. Okay, we're up to this point, and this being Boom, comp level 11, uh, with some effects you may not see in vanilla, but well, you wouldn't see this. You've got two key switches, and those doors open just when both switches have been flicked. So there's some shotgun guys approaching, which is a shame because they make the same noise. As the manka buses. Yeah. Just gotta be a bit careful here to peekaboo shoot accurately. There's one more. Tense right now. It's a manga bus that comes. Okay. Just looking at my shells to make sure I don't suddenly run out of ammo. If I got my angles lucky, I could kill the shotgun guy with the manga bus when I move like that. Okay, just, oh yes, he was about to shoot. Oh, that was so tense. Okay, three more monsters are hiding around the corner here. Let's kill them in one shot. Beautiful. One time that didn't work at all and none of them died. came up. Another chain gun again. We're about to meet another new enemy for Valiant, guys. It's the Pyro Knight. Let's activate them. And get out, because Pyro Knights are very vicious. You're hearing an imp, by the way, which I activated in the final trap area ahead of time. It's some sort of bug. Oh yes, I used the barrels very well there. And when Pyro Knights die, they're like Hell Knights but release a massive volley of projectiles. They leave this lovely little neat pile of ash. and knows that it's not as strong as them. But there's no hiding from Doom Guy today. Right, so I've got all 46 items and it's time for the blue key trap. Okay, that wall's gonna come down. 
when I grab the blue key, I'm going to need to run from lots of monsters that are teleporting in. Let's go. Yes. So there should be another 24 enemies. These are Valiant Pinkies, by the way, which are more dangerous than normal Doom Pinkies because they bite quicker. So we're hearing some... Shotgun guys approaching. So careful right now. Oh yes. Oh, this is scary. I've got. Oh, I've, I've got to use my plasma. A little bit of plasma. Oh, I've got away with it. Oh, that was so tense. <sighs> right. I've not got this far yet in a valid attempt. I need to grab some more ammo. Oh no, don't tell me there are no bullets around. I normally have some bullets left at this stage, guys. But I think because I've been hanging back more, because it's been a proper attempt instead of practice, I don't think I've got the ammo I would normally have at this stage, so I'm going to have to make more use of the super shotgun. Now, I've got Impi activated earlier. I didn't actually pick up the blue key. This is how nervous I am. I actually... <laughs> I didn't grab it because I just went far enough to trigger the trap. Seven bullets. Well, that won't get me anywhere. I use a single barrel shotgun. Okay, when I go in here, I'm trapped. 10 enemies, including a new enemy. So let's go. So I'll kill him. And I will use the super chain gun for this bit. So as I retreat to here, we see suicide bombers. Phew, got away with it. I just about had enough bullets for that. Okay. There's a shotgun guy. I want to kill him there. He was actually facing this way and in ambush mode, but I made I dragged him this way on purpose so that um, his corpse wouldn't be in front of here, which is where an arch file is going to come out. Okay, here goes. It means to activate that suicide bomber. just about hit from the arch file and got away with it and I had to avoid stepping into poison there's little squares of poison around me here so there's three more suicide bombers that one's already gone just let him approach oh, one more one more monster yes I've done it there are no monsters remaining! Oh, I wasn't going to mess around like the scene over there against the last <laughs> suicide bomber. Oh my gosh, I've done it! This switch opens a door. I've just got to not step in these bits of poison. So if I was missing any items or a secret or anything, I could go back for it. I'm not. So I'll lower the exit. And that's it. No damage completion on implosion. Wow. 
I am pleased and relieved to have succeeded at this challenge, guys, but it's a shame my silly mistakes dragged things out. I'm proudest of my tactics at the start. Valiant imps don't respond to a polite excuse me, so I had to blow them out of the way and follow in their wake. Still saw cleverly blends the modified monsters and weapons with the originals we already know and love. However, the MBF format, or Comp Level 11, gave me a tricky technical problem. A few weeks before recording this video, I kept finding that this wall, near the blue key, wouldn't come down for me. I did have the latest version of Valiant, so I was very confused. Until Shepardus on Doom World pointed out that the compatibility settings in PR Boom Plus affect how Comp Level 11 behaves. So, to record Valiant demos correctly, you must have the default settings. Yes, for dead players can exit, and no for everything else. I had messed with my settings a while back, but only on Comp Level 11 did it come back to bite me. I'm glad I solved the problem so I could bring you these awesome explosions. Make sure to subscribe with notifications on, there's more Valiant coming to PJ Plays Doom. Until next time, take care of yourselves and of Doom Guy. Goodbye.